Preparing for the Mr. Universe competition, Andy McBride puts himself through the punishing paces that will deliver victory for the current Irish champion. This is the toughest of challenges and diet is at the centre of potential success. The preparation for the competition started 14 weeks out. Basically involved an almost off-season, what they call an off-season diet. Lots of calories. During those uh, first four weeks from 14 to 10, I was eating lots of salmon, lots of chicken, and lots of red meat, along with white rice, porridge, and occasionally lots of potatoes. From four weeks to the day of the competition, all turkey is replaced by cod, white fish. So it's the same amount and same weight to replace the same quantity of, of protein, and the carbohydrates remain the same, a small quantity of brown rice and porridge. During training, his girlfriend prepares seven meals a day for him. Then it's off to the gym for five two-hour weekly sessions, plus 50 minutes of cardio workouts morning and evening. There's always an old saying, what put the muscle there will keep the muscle there. And I tend to lift relatively heavy in the off-season and I try to do the same pre-contest. However, about four to five weeks out from the competition, your carbohydrate levels are very low, your body fat is very low, you find that you're more susceptible to injury. So what you do is you drop your weights back maybe 20 or 30% and increase the number of repetitions. All you're trying to do here is fatigue the muscle because the last four to five weeks, you aren't for building any muscle. Because you're dieting, you're trying to maintain all the muscle you've got and burn off all the excess fat to come in in your best condition. Andy holds an impressive four IPF Irish records in powerlifting. In 2004, he came third in the 105 kilograms category of Britain's strongest man. Andy McBride is indeed a force to be reckoned with.